hi you guys welcome back to my youtube channel disclaimer it is sunday in la and the ice cream trucks are rolling the kids are outside playing you might hear my family out in the other room talking and stuff if you do hear that i apologize but i'm about to film this because i've done i tried to film this more than one time so let's get, get it going, going. So I have a review slash demo for you guys. I recently purchased a new Anastasia Beverly Hills highlighters. Yes, I know. Me buying Anastasia Beverly Hills, what is the world coming to? But they're highlighters. And you know, I'm a bit OD on my highlighters. I just love me a good highlight. And that's all I could say. I love me a good highlight. <laughs> yes. But she dropped four. Um, the names of them are So Hollywood. Peach Nectar, Riviera, and Starlight. I myself purchased three out of four and the ones I bought was So Hollywood which will be the popular highlighter of them all. Peach Nectar and Riviera. Let me tell you something about, let me tell you a little story real quick about So Hollywood. They say So Hollywood is supposed to be a dupe for Whisper of Guilt. When Whisper of Guilt first dropped, the first time because you know they released it twice the first time that it dropped i purchased it right i did not know what a highlighter was and this is when i was this is when i first got into makeup and i had it and i didn't know what the f it was so i went and i took it back yes something is wrong with me i took it back and i returned it because i did not know how to use it not knowing that it would be my obsession later on in life so i'm a bit mad at myself for that so because I've ha I've had whisper of guilt and I tried it so Hollywood is a good ass dupe for that particular highlighter but anyway let's talk about the product right in a little box like this you have the Anastasia Beverly Hills name with the little logo and it says illuminator on the bottom and it has and it tells you how many ounces and grams of the product that comes in the little packaging which is what nine grams 32 ounces and it tells you the shades that comes in the back and the ingredients and so the back says uh, a powder highlighter that delivers a natural luminizing glow blends effortlessly <laughs> i hate that word sorry into the skin will not crease or settle yeah and it just says distributed by blah 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 so let's get into the product which one should I talk about first so let's get into the highlighters this bad boy is the famous so Hollywood right I see why everybody like this Lo or love this should I say highlighter this highlight it's so bomb okay let me try to describe it for you guys it's like it's a pressed powder but it's soft not it it kind of feels like color pop when you place your finger on it like you know that moussey texture but it's finely milled pop powder and that powder goes on so smooth and it's not like a glittery it's just like a luminous highlight on your skin and so let me i'm gonna swatch it for you guys that right there bad bad boy right there is so hollywood and it's not glittery it's just powder and it just sits and glow and like i understand the hype on this i do i understand it the next color is called peach nectar and this is an apricot gold highlight right look at it isn't it so pretty like i just want to bathe in this shit like it's just so bomb but I must watch this one for you guys too. Like, look. I don't know. I think these are going to replace my my MAC highlighters. Like, I'm just in love with these. I've been wearing them nonstop. This is Riviera. This bad boy is a true rose gold highlight. And just like the others, it's finely milled. It goes on like a dream. <laughs> like, I seriously think this is about to take over my MAC highlighters because these are bomb. I'm going to swatch it for you. And this. 
It's Riviera. Wow. Excuse my hairy arm. I am African and I don't want to take that hair off my arm because it's just going to grow back and I'm going to look like a wildebeest. So there you go. Hollywood, Peach Nectar, and Riviera. I these three are a chocolate girl's dream. So if you are interested in purchasing these Anastasia Beverly Hills highlights, I must say, go do it. They're bomb. Bomb. That's all I can say. Bomb. <laughs> so, yes. Um, in a demo, you're going to see me use two brushes. These are the Real Techniques foundation brush and the contour brush. I like to use both of these. This to apply the highlight on and this to buff it out. I feel like the finish is just flawless it makes you look airbrush it doesn't look like you it doesn't look like you put something there it just looks like oh you glowing girl like that's how it makes you feel i like i literally been wearing this highlight for some time and i must say they're bomb so if you're interested and you're a dark skin girl or just a girl in general like girl you better go out and buy that highlight i support this and let me tell you another thing okay I want to clarify some things because I have a video on YouTube and it's called I don't like Anastasia Beverly Hills I just want to I just want to clarify some things because I still get comments to this day on that video and it's females defending the brand okay listen I don't I have a love and hate relationship with that brand. Some products I just don't understand and don't get. Some products that they put out was rushed. Like the new liquid, the liquid lipsticks that they first dropped out. Those was rushed. And the consistency of them was horrible. And the cream contour kit. Like it was hard to blend out. And they say use oils to make it work. I tried the oils and it works. Okay. It does work. But... I'm an oily person, so why would I want to put makeup with more oil than I need on my face? Like, it, that just doesn't make sense to me. But, like, there th there's things that I do like, like the powder contour kit. This contour kit is not sold in stores. You'll have to make your own contour kit. This contour kit works for me, okay? They revamped the liquid lipsticks. That The formula that I have that's in these new liquid lipsticks are not the same formula that was in their first drop their first launch at all because i bought midnight and midnight goes on so perfect it feels like i don't want to say it, but lime crime but it feels like a lime crime lipstick it goes on smooth it dries fast and it's long lasting the new the first formula was not like that the first formula was shit but this is the shit like you know so it's like there's products that i hate and products that i love from this brand and I adore these, okay? These are the biz the business. And like I said, if you're a dark skinned girl, you need these into you need these in your collection. Or any girl in general, you need this in your collection. Like these highlighters are bomb. And it's coming from me, a person that has a love and hate relationship with this brand. So I don't just completely hate them. Like I have products from this company. It's just you just gotta find what products works for you and figure out how to use them you get you get me but anyway i love you guys thank you for tuning in and i'm gonna show you the demo and you guys have a blessed day night weekend blah whatever i'll be back bye little mama said she like when i sing so i said i'm gonna sing something all the way through one time so this will be it I don't know why, but these bad bitches make me sad. Ay, 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 ay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ay, 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 I don't know why making this money make me sad. Ay, 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 ay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ay, 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 ay. I don't know why riding with my niggas make niggas hate. Let's celebrate. Follow my gram, let me navigate. Feels good to have my jams rockin' shit Without never degrading this copy shit This diamond lane shit I ain't nothing without the squad Get religious for a second I ain't nothing without my God Where the sky Point up If you a joint Roll the joint up How it blood on back with whatever you do No niggas gon' hate you for whatever you do And that's cool with me I put that on the gang That's on my jewelry Why would these bad bitches make me say What? I, 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 I. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, 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 I don't know why.
like making this money make me say Niggas